Thank you for tuning in and here's how to make a t-shirt icon from scratch in Adobe Illustrator. So we will start by creating a circle segment. I'm going to go over here and select the ellipse tool, press shift and draw an ellipse. Um, now we want to make the stroke bigger, so let's say 50 or 60. And we want to add anchor points. So you're going to go to Object, Path, Add Anchor Points. And we need to do it once again, actually. Great. Now that it's done, what we need to do is go to the Direct Selection tool, select this, select this ellipse, and delete all the anchor points except for the three that are at the very top. Let's do it. I'm going to click and drag with the direct selection tool and then hit backspace. Great. The second thing we need to do now is create a rectangle. Again, over here, rectangle tool, click and drag. And we don't want this rectangle to have a stroke. So I'm going to go over here switch to colors and disable the stroke. So it's just a rectangle with a black fill, very ordinary. We want to align these two um, like so. You see it's already, uh, it, it's already beginning to look like an actual t-shirt. We want to align them perfectly. And now it's, now it's up to you to kind of to adjust the proportions. I mean, for me now it looks that the shoulders need to be a little bit smaller and we are going to do that by enlarging the bottom part of the t-shirt, like so. This seems okay. Cool. Um, so this seems realistic to me. Um, now what we need to do is go again over here and select the ellipse tool, draw an ellipse, and we want to set it to white fill, set the opacity to around 50. We'll soon see why I'm doing this. Uh, make sure that it's um, the ellipse S is at the very top. So if if you move it over, over the t-shirt and it's actually behind the t-shirt, you need to go to object, arrange, bring to front. Uh, so this is already in the front. Um, we are, what we are doing right now is creating the cutoff for for the head. For me, it, I think this needs to be a little bit smaller. So let's let's make it a little bit smaller, like so. Um, so what we we will be doing is that we will be cutting out the the hole for the head basically from the from uh, this arc. Cool. To be able to cut through the actual shape, not just the stroke, because uh, it won't work that way. We need to convert the stroke into a shape, into an outline. So we, we do that by going to Object, Path, Outline Stroke. So now it's uh, an actual rectangle, a curved like rectangle, let's say. So this is in the front. We are going to select the ellipse and the shoulders and we are going to go to Pathfinder and select minus front. It's this icon over here. Cool. And now it actually looks like an actual t-shirt. That's, that's great. What we need to do now is create the pocket. Uh, again, go over to the rectangle tool, create a small rectangle. Let's make it uh, white. And I think we are good. We are good. Let's merge these two. Create a stroke. This one needs to be set to black. Make it, let's say, I don't know, 15. No, oh, that seems about right. This one will be 15 pixels tall as well. We need to round the corners a little bit by going here. And this seems fine. This seems like an 
like an actual t-shirt icon. We are done here. Thanks for tuning in and I will see you in the next one.